It's a project to celebrate Middlewich's contribution to the London 2012 Olympic torch relay. We've seen us make a great big enormous trainer. That was a brilliant example of unity in the sense that all of the participants came together. My name's Alison, this is Isaac. We're here at Nantwich Children's Centre and I think there's about 14 families all making a big mosaic to go up on the wall here at Nantwich Children's Centre and that's to commemorate the Olympics and the Olympic torch coming through Crewe. I'm Kerry Machin. I work with various community groups, schools, children's centres um, producing artworks in many different media. My name is Michael Troy. It's a moment to shine. It's cultural Olympiad and it's a fantastic opportunity for people who might not consider themselves to be sporty, but to actually consider what they've been good at, what they consider to be a moment in their life that they're going to cherish. And it's the opportunity then to do it in physical terms and create a piece of art from it. I'm Louise James. I'm a family service worker here at Nutsford Children's Centre. We've been running some workshops for Faith Bebbington to make some artwork for when the Olympic torch comes to Nutsford. Well, I think it celebrates uh, the Olympics coming. You know, no one will see the Olympics coming through in their lifetime again. And it gets everybody involved. And obviously physical exercise is another reason for being you know, good, so I'm sure there's studies to say that when the Olympics come to the country, more people are engaged in physical activity. Hello, I'm Vicky Wilson. I'm a community artist. My role is to engage in communities, um, helping people engage with the arts and create beautiful artworks. We're lucky in here in East Cheshire because East Cheshire have fully supported and have come up with great initiatives for Olympic years. So we're very appreciative of what East Cheshire have, have done for our county. OK, well, I'm Matt Baker. I'm Artistic Director of Theatre in the Quarter and, and I'm the composer of the anthems that are being sung uh, as the Olympic torch arrives at Tatton. The young people sing one which is called Be the Best That You Can Be and it adopts all the themes of, uh, of the Olympics. And it's all about striving to be the best that you can be and ultimately going for gold. So it has that real, real Olympic flavour. Yes, I'm Catherine Silman and I'm Anne Mitchell and together we are Cantar to Music Education. Basically we run community choirs for uh, people who've never sung before. Of course the, the performance is in two sections, there's the uh, largely children's section, Be the Best That You Can Be, and then the, it builds up to the, to the grand finale which is called Across the World. My name's John Hartshorn and I'm a carnival artist. I'm working actually as an artistic director for the Barnaby Carnival as a local festival. And when the Olympic torch relay came up, Barnaby asked if it could actually have a role in working with some young people to put a piece in. Um, well, there's going to be people on the floor as androids. There's going to be about four or five people on the float being part of the machine. And then we have drummers doing like songs that the robots can move to. 
I'm Jocelyn McMillan, I'm the Senior Arts Officer for Cheshire East Council. I've been involved for oh, at least the last 12 months organising local community groups and, and schools to animate the route um, for the torch relays that come through Cheshire East. I'm confident in some ways but there's loads of obstacles we've got to get through today to make sure that it's going to be alright and when we leave this afternoon it's got to be perfect. The children, parents and staff are all really having a good time. There's lots of laughter and real excitement about the torch coming. They've got their freebies and their ribbons and their flags to wave. It's, it's a wonderful, wonderful experience and the spirit is wonderful. Bringing people together in any sort of community this day and age is a very challenging thing to do. However you do it, it's amazing and, and long may the community feel continue. They really are enjoying themselves. The build-up has been really good. We've been working on the float and practising. Now is the big moment, can't wait. We're all enjoying ourselves and it looks like everyone else is enjoying themselves we're all smiling. We're in to support Amy Mercer Bailey, she's carrying the torch. Very exciting. I actually live outside Knoxford in Lower Peewa and I'm here because our Rotary Club put a request out for stewards for events and I thought, well, why not? An opportunity to put something back into society. has really been brought together as a community in order to do this and both the students and the staff are really excited about all coming here today. Well it's certainly raised the profile of Cheshire and we have to convince the public it doesn't always rain here but we, we are champions, we shine whatever the weather.